Glenn. Uh, I was a Republican from 1999 to 2016, and I left the Republican Party when, when Trump was elected. I served as a submarine officer in the Navy for about eight years, um, and I live in Maryland. The main things I care about are, are national security, competence, and civil liberties. And the reason I left the Republican Party was uh, because this administration stands for none of those things. My choice is reaffirmed every day, and it's become worse and worse. 2020 can be a, a turning point to bring the U.S. back to the main thing that I loved about it. My my family is a family of immigrants. Um, you know, I, I want I want um, uh, immigrants to feel welcome. I want stability. I want confidence in leadership. And so th the only way to get that is to get rid of Trump. The, the only thing that Trump is looking out for is himself. Um, when he raised his hand and he swore an oath to support and defend the Constitution, he he lied, and he's been lying about that. He doesn't care about the Constitution. I mean, military people come from all walks of life. They have different political beliefs, but they, they raise their right hand and they swore an oath to the Constitution. Um, and, you know, it, it, it hurts us when, when people break that oath and to watch it over and over and over again and to have no accountability uh, is, is just, it just makes you angry. And the fact that military leaders are being asked every day to to figure out whether or not they ha they're they're following lawful and constitutional orders um it, it doesn't just hurt the military but it hurts it hurts the uh civilian control of the military and it hurts the democracy to me you know the, the only clear choice is is biden i think that uh what biden does bring is experience in, in terms of foreign policy and, and national security i think he has a lot of credibility he surrounds himself with a lot of smart people and i and i know um that he at a minimum, is going to restore confidence to the office of the presidency, which is, you know, it, it sounds like a low bar, but but we're not there yet. But but for now, Biden is, is the only choice.